There have been many studies on microplastic pollution in the oceans, but there are only few papers uh, talking about the microplastic pollution in the lakes. We studied the pollution of the Lake Geneva by microplastics, and we find a lot of these uh, small particles of plastics in the waters and also in the beaches of the lakes. So we find uh, typically Q-tips, uh, like uh, polystyrene uh, that float, uh, fragments from bigger objects uh, that break up and are hard to identify, uh, and also primary microplastics. Uh, we're most surprised about the amount of primary microplastics, that is the pellets used uh, by the industry and the micro pebbles used in the cosmetics. The birds or the fish, when they ingest these plastics, they can suffocate. And when animals ingest the plastics, some of the components of the plastics can be liberated in the stomach of the animals, and, can, uh, and these uh, components can be toxic for the animals. And uh, we are also studying the, 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 the possibility that um, adsorbed hydrophobic pollutants on the surface of this plastic can also be liberated in the stomach of the birds and fish. The next step of our work will be to extend uh, the investigations on the pollution by microplastics in different uh, lakes and rivers in Switzerland.